Hi, I'm Marco with our washers at washmart.com. This is going to be a very simple video. I'm going to show you how to be able to split your machine to where if you want to run it two guns. Now be advised, whenever you run two guns, you're going to be splitting your gallons per minute. So let's say, for instance, we have a 3,008 GPM unit. Whenever you split it two ways, you're going to need to go from a 9 orifice tip to a 4.5. So you're going to be getting approximately 4 GPM at 3,000 PSI per lance. Um, so I want to show a small demonstration on how this can be done very simply and you're looking at maybe $70 in parts. It's pretty inexpensive. Anyways, we're about to get started. Okay, so we have the pressure hose which is coming from the pressure washer. Okay. You follow this along this line here, and it goes into this reel. That's going to be 8 gallons per minute. What we're going to do is we are going to put, we call it a whip line. It's people, they, there's so many different names for these. But we're going to use a 3 8 pressure hose. I want to show you all the different tools that we're going to need to do this. Item number one, we're going to use a half inch by 3 8 hex bushing. So we're going to have half inch by male pipe threaded, MPT, which is going to go on the second reel. Note, this is for video only, where obviously you're going to want to put thread lock or Loctite or lock seal or Teflon, whatever your preference is. Then we're going to have the 3 8 female pipe threaded. Now, on this part, on the whip line, we have a swivel end where it spins, and then we have a non-swivel end right here that's stiff. Put the non-swivel end first and put it on the reel. Okay, so now we've bushed this half inch swivel to three eighths, like the pressure hose we have here. Next, we're going to put on this three eighths double sided female pipe threaded or FPT, three eighths ball valve. It's known as the DN10. This is going to be the most reliable ball valve that we have ever used. And we are going to put it on this end. Now that this is on, whenever you use this, whenever you turn it off, you're running 8 gallons a minute on this reel. Whenever it is on, you're running 4 gallons a minute, 4 gallons a minute. Dual gun process. Now we're going to use this T. It's a 3 8 T. This is going to be male pipe threaded by female pipe threaded by female pipe threaded. We're going to put this T right here. Now that that's on, we're going to use this 3 8 by 3 8 hex nipple. Some people just call it a nipple. This is going to connect this to the T. Okay. Now you're going to see why I picked this side to be the swiveled end. If this was the hard end, and you had the swivel end up here, this would not be nearly as easy as this is right now to connect. And then lastly, we put the pressure as it comes from the pressure washer onto this T. Hence we have the swiveled end here. That's also going to make this easy. Okay, now that it's done, we wanted a precaution to not run this as a hot water unit whenever you're using this as a dual gun operation. This machine's intended to be run with hot water eight gallons a minute, not four. So, as a precautionary, we do not recommend running this as a hot water with a dual lance because if this person takes a break with hot water and this person continues to clean, the heat rise is going to be much higher 
than if it was running at a single eight gallon a minute, which can cause issues and it is a safety concern. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any comments, please post down on below. And thank you for shopping at Washmart.